All right, here we have a protractor. Protractors measure angles in degrees. A circle has 360 degrees, and this is a half circle. So how many degrees can we measure with this? Well, you could divide 360 by two, or you can just look at it. It goes all the way from zero to 180. An easy way to use protractors is to first draw a straight line using either the bottom of the protractor that's straight or a ruler. Draw your line and pick a dot around which you would like to make your angle. Now place this cross right on top of that dot so that way your bottom line matches the line that you drew. All right. Now we're going to pick an angle that we want to draw. Let's say we want to do 50 degrees. All right, so we find 50 on the protractor. And we follow that line, make a dot, move the protractor, and draw a line connecting these two dots. Now we have an angle of 50 degrees. Some people that make sundials like to just use a protractor. They'll measure 90 degrees to point north. And then this would point east. And this would point west. Then what they would do is they would measure out where they want to put all the numbers between 12 o'clock or noon and really whatever they want to do. So they can just go from this point, they're 90 degrees, and measure let's say 20 degrees. And so right here they'll put one o'clock in the afternoon. And then here, they'll say two o'clock in the afternoon. And they'll keep doing that until they go through the whole day, and then they'll work backwards. So go backwards by 20 degrees, and you are at 11 in the morning. And you do that until you have all of your times written down and then you position your sundial in a way that will make this accurate. All right, so that's one way of doing it.